to Mike Riley, no player liked him and no manager liked him as a referee. Um, I think that's true to Stephen now as, as a general manager. You don't hear from him, do you? He doesn't come out, he doesn't talk, he doesn't defend his, his referees. The general manager should come out like, like a manager could, comes out and defends his players to the hill, even though if he's done something wrong. And the general manager should, should be coming out. I mean, Pete Walton, yes, who, yes. Went, who went for the job, a, lot, a, a good ref, a good friend of mine, Pete Walton, went for the job with, with Mike Riley. And Keith Hackett, Hackett strongly recommended that Pete Walton should get the job. Pete Walton has been in charge of many, many men. He was a big manager, mm -hmm. um, a big player for Eon. Okay, so he knows how to manage people, treat people, talk to people. Okay, now he's gone across to the MLS and he's doing a terrific job by all accounts. All accounts doing a terrific job. Now he goes out and talks to the media on behalf of his referees when when something's happened, when they've got a big key match incident wrong. That's what should what should happen here. But unfortunately, you know, and everybody would tell you this, Mike Riley cannot do that. He cannot he cannot do that. He doesn't know how to talk to people. Other referees are frightened. They're absolutely frightened to say anything because they know it will come back to haunt them. They go missing. Referees at this level now, yeah. at the select group level, are frightened. I know Dermot Gallagher and Alan Wiley, that work for, and, who now work for PGML, who go in and, and, and talk to Sky Sports News on a Monday, okay? they are allowed to talk, talk to the referees if they've made a mistake on that weekend, right. and so they can talk about it on a Monday, right? right. But they have to tow the party line, they have to say what Mike Wiley tells them to say. Well, it's sounding more and more like a dictatorship. I've just... I've, you took the words right out of my mouth.